<laughs> okay, next up in our easy cooking today is Massimo, and he is making a chicken arugula salad. Let's take a look. <laughs> Very good, Chef. Yeah. So what are you what are you making for us? Well, uh, sorry to do that to all of you. I mean, I called it uh, chicken paillard. Yes. Paillard is an old name from the 70s, and uh, I'm sorry, I'm still stuck over there. Yeah. And what is it? What's a paillard? <laughs> it's basically a chicken cutlet, very, very thin chicken cutlet. Okay. And this is what I've been eating a lot in the last little while, because it's summertime, I want to eat something light. So, yes. you know, a beautiful chicken breast, uh, butterfly, and then pound it down, nice and easy. If you can throw this on the grill over there, it's already mm. pre-seasoned. I of did course, that yeah. just before. Uh, give it a good quadrillage as well. You know What's what a mean? quadrillage? What? Yeah. The, the little, little grill. Crisscross. Grill cross, oh. man. Oh, that's a... Uh, <laughs> Fancy. That's from the 70s too. That's from the 70s too. I'm so sorry. <laughs> back. So I've been eating a lot of that because it, it's nice, it's delicate, it's fresh, it's yeah. uh, actually very light. And uh, with that, a beautiful arugula salad. But me, I am kind of tired of arugula, but mm. it really works well with this. So what I do is I like to create nice warm vinaigrettes. I don't like anything cold. Yes. Oh. So I have in this pan of here, I have olive oil, I have shaved garlic, okay. and I have onions. So now it we're gonna turn the fire so up a little good. bit. We just sweat it. Do we do that? Yeah. Oh, I like yeah. the sweat idea of making up. a warmer vinaigrette. That's an interesting idea. Yeah, I like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like with something it's a little bit more. It's more of a meal. It feels like more of a meal. And loosen yeah. up the greens. Yeah, loosen yeah. up the greens a little bit. Mm -hmm. So that, that that works well actually with escarole. It works well with uh, hardier lettuces, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, we've done that not too long ago actually yep. with the endive and all. You know, I mean, it's a very interesting look at that, huh? Okay, That's so we good. have uh, fennel. Hey, I love it. You know, <laughs> turn it up, make sure it's high. All right, we have fennel. I love fennel. It's nice and sweet. When you just give it a quick scalding, mm -hmm. it becomes absolutely delicious. So I'm going to put some of this in here. Good sized chunks. Just like that. Yeah, nice uh, cube. You know what I mean? You can do them by machine, or you can have a wow. cup that you pay money to. Oh, yeah. And you can <laughs> <laughs> I need one of those season in my up. house, actually. Yes. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's it. Season up, salt, pepper. Uh, you can put thyme in it if you like. I mean, if you're so inclined, it's not a problem. Okay. And then you have diced tomato, just like that. Just cook it up a little bit. Yeah, give it a minute. Maybe add a little bit more um, oil, oil because yeah. Yeah, it needs Starting a little bit. Perfect. There. Are you turning it? Are you flipping it? Perfect. This is the quantity. Now, we got vinegar over here. Uh, we are okay with there's no allergies of vinegar in the area, right? I mean, uh, no, because we're, I good. we're good. good. We're good. We're good. We're good. good. Okay, yeah. beautiful. Okay. But you saw. Don't stick your face in there with you. Like yeah, don't breathe back. Back. Yeah. Everybody's you allergic go. to vinegar when you breathe it. Okay. You know? Okay, it takes your breath away. So basically <laughs> what you want to do is you just want to push it lightly. You want the crunch, you want to still keep it raw. Okay. And uh, you want to evaporate the acidity of the vinegar. You want to retain the sweetness. Mm -hmm. So with that, we're going to help it a little bit with a pinch of sugar. Just a little, oh. little tiny, tiny pinch. Nice. Okay? You could do it with balsamic vinegar. If you have white balsamic, perfect. Otherwise, don't worry about it. And how is it? Is it's it grilling? Is it grilling? It. Yeah, oh, it Flip is. Flip it over, yeah. No, I don't want to overcut it. Perfect. Over. This is right on the money. Oh, yeah. oh looks good. Okay. <laughs> yeah, beautiful, beautiful, oh. beautiful. Now we're going to add our tomatoes. Okay. Fresh tomato. Make it. Make sure you buy tomato at this time of the year especially. They're not really local in season right now. I mean, we're still a little bit young. Yeah. Okay, so you just want to use the tomato to cool off the whole vinaigrette. And Put it, it in your pan. There we go. That's all you have to do, really. That is cool. Very simple. Uh, don't spill it as much as I did. Yeah, that's fine. Right. <laughs> <laughs> just anyway, this is your vinaigrette, right? You, you can use this to dress that salad. So when the chicken is ready, we're going to put it on... Uh, on the board, very close. On your plate, this is your plate right here. Lovely, I like right. that. Is it ready? Uh, it's not ready yet. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I've done. All right. <laughs> not so, ready, no. When you're doing chicken at home, you don't want to dirty everything. You just use your trusty little saran wrap. Put okay. the chicken in between the two pieces of uh, saran wrap so that they don't run everywhere. It, it also allows it to slide yeah, out a little exactly. bit with the saran wrap. Or if you're on the board, it might tear it and Exactly. Rip it. Yeah. And, and, and then you have to wash the board and you have to wash everything on top of it. I mean, yeah. it's a pin in the neck. So yeah. I have my trusty little pounder. And all I want to do, or you can tell your butcher to do it for you, and they all will be able to do that. Nice now. try it. Perfect. Get in there, Chase. And this is really good oh, around the oh, kids. Oh, you know that is very heavy. Chase, you want to do this in the kids or around and intimidate them a little bit. There you go. See, that's easy, right? You want to do it about a quarter inch thick. That was Because fun. you want a little meat. 
Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And then you just season it, and there you go. So now, yeah. put the put your uh, lettuce on top here. A oh, nice bowl. Oh, this is good because the chicken is yes. like a plate. That's <laughs> right. That's my it kind is. of plate. And then you just put your uh, your dressing one. all around it. Ooh. That's all you have to do, really. And this is so fresh, so oh, exciting, so beautiful. easy. You know, you can't go wrong you with something like that. You know what? It's yeah. just such a small twist. That's How right. many of us have had a Put salad a with of, uh, chicken? This is such a nice twist, though. Exactly. Summary. Look at this. That's lovely. A little bit of that, and then you just serve it to your Lunch family. slash dinner well, slash lunch. the meal Whatever. is served. You can like that. That's it. It's just the way it's been, you know, all plated and put out there.